Hi, I'm Pat Paul from Dynamic Diamond Tooling. In this next video, I want to show you how to properly install squeegees or the brushes that you see on here and also adjust the wheels. Take your Phillips head screwdriver. We're going to remove these four can head screws. Now, if you have an Urmator vacuum, you're going to leave your squeegees right in these bottom plastic strips. If you have a DDV vacuum, you're going to remove the squeegee from the plastic. And if you notice, there's a long and a short squeegee. Pull those out. You're going to reinstall them. into the DDV plastic strips. Now when working with the squeegees, if you'll notice the squeegees have a serrated side to them. One side is smooth, the other side is serrated. The idea of the serrations is to make sure that dust can freely flow underneath the squeegee blade entering into the floor tool. Your serrations are always going to face out. The long squeegee is going to go up front. Shorter squeegee goes in the back. Again, the serrations will face backward. So the smooth side of the squeegee is facing in, serrated side out. We're then going to reinstall our holding clips. Now we're going to take our screws, put our screws back in. Now we want to adjust the height of the wheels. As you can see, we have the wheels, the wheel bar which is a holder to them, and then the adjustment knob, which is right here. The adjustment knob is going to adjust those wheels up or down, raising or lowering our squeegee to our floor. So right now, as you can see, we're sitting above the floor. You want to adjust that squeegee down a little. So by backing this nut out, it's going to raise the wheels up, lowering the squeegee. Now you can hear we're dragging the floor. That's right where we want to be. When you're operating the tool, you want to leave the tool as flat as possible, so you're running across the floor, keeping a good seal, making sure all the dust is being pulled into the vacuum. So when you're going forward, going backwards, you have that good seal, keep it nice and level. If you own a vac mop, sold by Dynamic Diamond Tooling, it has two heads on it, as you can see, heads identical to these. You adjust the wheels the exact same way. Thanks so much.